All right, hello yet again, everyone. Um, this is the second video in a row now. I literally got a notification from Discord saying Lando posted a leak right after I finished exporting the last video. So here I am making another video. I love these times of the year where I'm insanely active. I'm, oh, well, I mean, I haven't uploaded since a little over a week, but you know, when there's act, there's a lot of stuff going on. And as you can clearly see on the screen right now, this is the new leak that Lando posted, and well, I don't know what else this could possibly be but an arcade. And we have two games here, Dodgy Dobo, which is 100% Flappy Bird, which I'm pretty sure was a mini game, in Pokemon Brick Bronze's arcade, and then Disc Drop is probably that kind of like fruit collecting game where you're just going from side to side across the screen and you gotta collect the falling fruit. So there we go, we've got two arcade games right there, and if anyone remembers the arcade from Anthean City back in Brick Bronze, we know that there should be prizes in this arcade that you can buy with tickets and in brick bronze you got some pretty good stuff you got you could buy a ditto you could get a chancy and i believe you could even get a different hoverboards i don't know what they would replace the hoverboards with nor the pokemon or lumians in this case it's definitely going to be interesting to see what kind of prizes they come up with this time I don't know if there's going to be a new Lumion. It would be funny if there's literally just like an arcade machine Lumion. That would actually be pretty sick. Um, and speaking of Lumions, we get a much, much clearer look at this Lumion here. Much clearer look. Because before, it was in a Twitter compressed MP4 and it didn't look great. Now we can see a lot of details. It's got this little underbite going, it has some bolts and screws in it. The eye actually isn't just a red circle with an iris. It's actually got like a robotic kind of feel to it. And yeah, now we have like a very high res image of this Lumion, so that's great. We still can't see the front of the thing yet, but you know, it's definitely giving off a better impression last time because it was very low quality. I think the design might have changed a bit as well, though admittedly that leak came out a while ago so I'm probably just not remembering it correctly. But to me it does look like there's been some slight changes to it. I mean I wouldn't be surprised, you know. They they released leaks of Illumion like a very long time before we actually get to see them in the game so it, you know sometimes you should be expecting changes to happen. That's a car in the background. That's actually a plane, never mind. Well, anyway, uh, enough distractions. Uh, that's pretty much all there is to say about this. It's the arcade. I'm not that incredibly surprised that it's coming back. I kind of expected pretty much everything from Anthean to come back because, you know, this update has been taking so long. So I was kind of expecting them to just have everything ready. I don't think they're going to have apartments ready because it wasn't necessarily an Anthean thing. It was just kind of the center for apartments. There were a lot of apartments there. It would be interesting though if apartments came with this update as well because I think people would love that. Yeah, if we were to believe that the arcade isn't the only thing coming back, we're probably going to see the Lucky Lotto as well where you come back daily and you test your luck and get some cool prizes. Um, they're definitely bringing back the museum, because I'm pretty sure that's what that tweet was with them asking for fan art. And, um, there were other things. There was the hoverboard shop, which I don't know if they're just not going to do anything with that. Or maybe there's going to be like a mount shop or something. Maybe like robotic Lumions, so you can have like specifically made things so it doesn't feel weird like you're just buying a living creature it's a robot i don't know maybe they'll finally add some sort of way to get evolution items without having to do pvp because i'm that's still really annoying to me that i have to do pvp to get a thunder fruit 
and I'm pretty sure Anthene City was where you could get all the evolution stones, including mega stones. So hopefully that's added, because I would love to not need to do PvP just so I can get a berry to evolve my Lumions. But yeah, there's other things of course, but obviously the main thing going on here is the arcade. And it's just looking pretty good, you know, you got that classic retro arcade floor. Got some two games, and you got the Shark Loom. Pretty good leak. Right, at this point, I'm just waiting to see the poster. But yeah, with that being said, that's about all for this video. And yeah, look at that proper outro this time. I'll see you again next time.